Hey guys, Beast here. And uh, today what I want to talk about, like the title says, is about groove rings. Uh, if you guys know, back at the channel we took a trip, my fiance and I, in the East Coast, all the hot springs. I'll put a link up there in the video. Before that trip, she was not my fiance, however. Uh, by the end of that trip, she was. It was getting near our anniversary. One of the things I used was groove rings. Something we had sort of talked about. Um, another video I've been asked to do is sort of my workout, fitness, weight loss journey over the last couple of years. Um, I may get to that. It's extremely personal. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that video. But along with um, personal videos is, is basically the, the groove rings. I want to make it for a couple different reasons. One, silicone rings have become really popular the last couple of years. Um, you know, it started out as sort of a workout. Hardworking professionals would use them. Now a lot of people are switching to them. Um, you know, hunters, outdoor enthusiasts, just every day. This is my everyday ring for the moment. Uh, we'll, I'm sure we'll re replace those with something else. But, um, you know, it sort of it started as a symbol of my, uh, my love and affection as I was leaving to get on the ship and was going to be gone for a very long time. As you know, I work uh, out of the country in Antarctica, if you follow the channel for any length of time, through the North American winters. Um, and after that trip we did with the hot tub, I won't get too personal, but that's when we uh, became more official. Um, using these rings has been great. Working on the ship, I'm working around heavy equipment, cranes, things of that nature. You know, rings are inherently dangerous uh, for working professionals. Whether you're, you know, mechanic welder, the, the list goes on. Working out all the time, you don't want to have, you know, a really, really nice ring. I will say the, the other trend lately is very hard metals. Tungsten and carbides and titaniums. Um, I have a working professional that does a lot of uh, finishing work and his ring is tungsten and it mars up any white porcelain sink that he's working on and so he has to take his ring off. Um, it's kind of a weird feeling once you get used to wearing your wedding ring or you know engagement ring for a long time not to have it. Um, I'll put in pictures as I talk here but I've been using it for over a year and absolutely love it and I would say out of all the silicone rings I don't know that I would go to any other company versus this um, I didn't think I would get any sort of fancy patterns on this but I'll show a quick photo of the one that we're doing and then we'll talk about the ring here on the table but this one is fantastic um, for someone who wasn't used to wearing any sort of rings and never been married previously or engaged previously um, it's very comfortable to get used to it's easy to wear um, you will see I get uh, kind of more of a callus near my ring I'm sure that happens for a lot of workout professionals and a lot of people that use their hands my summer job is wildland firefighting um, you know to, to outlast that the warranty on this and we'll talk about that here as well is important with groove life because it's basically no BS, 94 plus years, basically your lifetime, I will always replace this ring. Now with that, you're gonna be doing that a lot. If you are a hardworking professional and you're using your hands, the reason you got the ring to start with and you're not just using it to throw on when you go to the gym and then you're putting your regular ring back on, um, be aware you are gonna be replacing this a lot. This is my third or fourth one of the same one, replaced happily by Groove Life. Um, I think the last time I got around Christmas time when I was home um, off the ship because it started cracking and um, I'll pull this one off and we'll take a look at it and I'll show you what it looks like compared to the other ring. My fiance is also a working professional in the nursing field and she's struggling with hers um, simply because we believe it might be the hand sanitizer that she's constantly using. Every time she enters and leaves a room in the hospital, she's hand sanitizing her hands. And we think that ring is becoming hard. And I'll put in a quick video here and some pictures of her ring. Um, it was a size five and I had to size up for hers because it kept getting hard and kind of shrinking to the point where she couldn't put it on and she would leave it in a pocket. And once she lost it, the other time she just didn't feel like putting it back on because it was uncomfortable. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to keep replacing hers. Uh, she really loves it. She loves it for all the same reasons I've been talking about, but she hasn't been wearing it lately um, because it's just uncomfortable and I've, I don't know if I'm just going to get another replacement for it or not, um, which is unfortunate. So I, th I think it's reacting with the sanitizer. Um, I don't have that problem. My problem that I'll show you down here, throwing some photos, when I was on the ship, I noticed it was cracking. Um, some of the decals are wearing off and then even the one right now the reason I've got the new one in the bag that we're going to show you in a second is simply because it's just wearing out. 
All right, well, there's the old and new, again, side by side. You can see it gets a little yellow. There's definitely a big crack in this one. It's missing a lot of its patterns. Um, very comfortable to wear. And as you can see, you know, I've got a little mark, but it's dry underneath that finger. And uh, so when I'm washing my hands and going in and out and working on the truck, um, you know, this it's been great. I haven't worried about it. Um, you just have to realize that at some point down the road, you are going to have to take them up on their warranty offer. Um, I really wish that they wouldn't react to hand sanitizing. Um, otherwise, we have to order a few extra at some point. They are fairly inexpensive. They generally have pretty good deals. Uh, the other thing is you'll see the um, same one that I put in the clip of my fiance. They're nice and supple, and then eventually they just they kind of lose that after a while and so you just if you're going to use it all the time guys just be aware you're going to have to take them up on their lifetime warranty 94 years no bs so you know you're not out anything you just takes a few minutes online they send you an email you get it in this sort of low profile packaging otherwise your first time you do get a nice little metal box all right guys well like i said for all the reasons you know for actual finger injuries you know, there's talked to a lot of first responders. Those tungsten rings are really hard to cut with their ring cutters that they use. Um, if you end up in an accident, the fact that you could catch a ring and lose your whole finger, uh, there's a lot of different reasons just for comfort and everyday use to go with a, a silicone ring like Groove Life. I really like it because, again, no BS warranty. I like the fact it doesn't get all weird underneath my finger, uh, washes up good, and, you know, when I wear it out, a few, you know, minutes on an email. And I've got a new one in the mail coming. And so I'm going to put this one on right now. And I look forward to hearing your guys' comments, questions. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you are already wearing a silicone ring or a different brand. Um, again, Groove Life, it just works for me. Um, I'll probably go to more of a solid cut-in pattern onto the silicone instead of a pattern that's like printed on um, for the future but they've got good deals going all the time and uh, i wouldn't hesitate to order another one this has been beast with groove life rings thanks for watching guys thanks for all the love and support you guys are amazing please like share and subscribe follow the adventure on social media and we'll see you on the road